Why fast time call ended screen stuck on iPhone? And how to fix this issue easily? Actually, there are various reasons that could cause your iPhone stuck on call ended screen. Common ones are software system errors, or your iPhone is running out of storage space, or too many apps running in the background. Now let me tell you how to fix iPhone stuck on Fastum call ending screen. Solution 1. Force restart iPhone. If your iPhone stuck on call end screen, and you can't shut it down, then you can force restart your iPhone. For iPhone 6 or earlier, press and hold the power button and home button. Keep holding both buttons until the Apple logo appears. For iPhone 7, you need to press and hold the power button and volume down button, then keep holding the buttons until the Apple logo appears. For iPhone 8 or later, you need to press the volume up button first, then quickly press the volume down button. At last press the power button until Apple logo occurs. Solution 2. Force quit fast time and relaunch it. Force quit the fast time app is also a good solution whenever your iPhone stuck on call ended screen and you can relaunch it if you want to use fast time app again. Solution 3. Clear storage. Check if your iPhone storage is health. If possible, clean up a news data and media files to free up space on your Apple device. Solution 4. Fix iOS issues with JoyoShare Ultfix iOS system recovery. More than 150 problems can be solved with JoyoShare Ultfix iOS system recovery. Its utility capability extends to all types of iDavises, so no matter you want to fix iPhone stuck on call ended screen, fast time screen share not working, iPad won't turn on, or anything else from your iOS device. Moreover, JoyoShare Ultfix is very easy to use, it with a simple operation interface, just click a few buttons to easily solve the problems encountered by your iPhone, iPad or iPod Touch. Solution 5. Reinstall the FastTime app. Reinstalling the app should clear up any issues caused by an incomplete or corrupted installation, it is also a good solution for you to have a try. Solution 6. Reset all settings. On your iPhone, go to Settings, click General, click Transfer or Reset iPhone. Click Erase All Content Settings button, click Continue, and enter the passwords to confirm this action. That's all the video, hope above methods would help you. See you next time.